CATL is the largest battery company worldwide, holding nearly 40% of the lithium-ion battery market. This dominance places it head and shoulders above any other company. The second key factor is technology CATL is recognized as the world's leading battery technology company, producing some of the best batteries available. Could you give us a glimpse into what new technologies CATL is working on and how much of a game changer these could be for the global energy transition? Yes, thank you for the question. Last year, we invested almost 20 billion RMB in R&D, focused solely on batteries. That's why we've introduced many different products to the market. The global battery manufacturing industry is currently reeling from a seismic shift that emerged just 45 minutes ago, sending shockwaves through boardrooms and production lines worldwide. The news centers on a groundbreaking development in sodium ion battery technology from China, spearheaded by CATL, the world's largest battery manufacturer. This innovation threatens to upend not only the electric vehicle EV market, but also the entire global energy storage and fossil fuel sectors, reshaping industries and consumer expectations in profound ways. The implications are staggering. Cheaper, safer, more durable batteries with superior performance in extreme conditions could redefine the economics of energy and transportation, leaving competitors scrambling and customers poised to reap unprecedented benefits. The South Korean automotive industry, which has poured hundreds of billions of dollars into battery production, is among the hardest hit. With factories already operating at less than 50% capacity due to China's growing dominance in the sector, this new development could further reduce utilization rates. South Korea's heavy investment in lithium-ion technology, particularly lithium-ion phosphate LFP batteries, now faces a formidable challenge from CATL's sodium-ion Nextra battery. This isn't just a South Korean problem. Any company competing against CATL, a titan in the battery industry, is watching this unfold with trepidation. This new battery can be charged in just 10 minutes to provide a 600 kilometers range. With LFP systems, it can reach up to 1,000 kilometers. Another focus of CATL's development is higher energy density, with condensed batteries reaching up to 500 watt-hours per kilogram. Unlike competitors who have overhyped unproven technologies like solid-state batteries, CATL has a strong track record of delivering on its promises. This raises concerns for manufacturers outside China because the challenge isn't just about keeping up, it's about survival in a market where the rules are being rewritten. For consumers, however, the news is revolutionary. Imagine batteries that cost half as much as today's LFP batteries, offer higher energy density, last three to five times longer, and operate flawlessly in temperatures ranging from 40 degrees Celsius to 60 degrees Celsius. These aren't incremental improvements, they're game changers. The Nextra battery's ability to maintain 90% of its usable capacity in extreme conditions addresses one of the most significant pain points for EVs, range loss in harsh weather. In cold climates, lithium-ion batteries can lose 40-50% of their range, a major drawback. Sodium-ion technology, by contrast, seems to solve this issue, offering consistent performance in both freezing and scorching conditions. The safety profile of these new batteries is equally compelling. Starting July 1, 2026, China will implement a new battery safety standard aimed at eliminating fire risks in EVs with strict requirements for thermal runaway protection. CATL's Nextra sodium ion battery has already demonstrated exceptional safety at both the cell and pack levels, passing rigorous tests. Unlike lithium-based batteries, which face scrutiny for fire risks, sodium ion batteries use abundant sodium instead of scarce lithium, reducing supply chain vulnerabilities and enhancing safety. Energy density, historically a weak point for sodium ion batteries, has also seen remarkable progress. For years, sodium batteries lag behind lithium ion in practicality. But recent advancements have flipped the script. The Nextra battery achieves 175 watt-hours per kilogram, surpassing the 160 watt-hours per kilogram of BYD's Blade battery, a benchmark in the LFP space. This means sodium ion batteries can now store more energy in a smaller, lighter package, while costing less than half as much as lithium ion batteries. The most jaw-dropping feature is their longevity, Cattle claims the Nextra battery retains 80% of its capacity after 3.6 million miles of driving an unprecedented figure in battery history. For comparison, most EV batteries today are considered durable if they last 200,000, 
300,000 miles. A battery that lasts millions of miles could outlive multiple vehicle life cycles and still be reused in homes or grids long after its automotive use ends. The safety profile of these new batteries is equally compelling. Starting July 1, 2026, China will implement a new battery safety standard aimed at eliminating fire risks in EVs, with strict requirements for thermal runaway protection. CATL's Nextra Sodium Ion Battery has already demonstrated exceptional safety at both the cell and pack levels, passing rigorous tests. Unlike lithium-based batteries, which face scrutiny for fire risks, sodium ion batteries use abundant sodium instead of scarce lithium, reducing supply chain vulnerabilities and enhancing safety. Energy density, historically a weak point for sodium ion batteries, has also seen remarkable progress. For years, sodium batteries lagged behind lithium ion in practicality, but recent advancements have flipped the script. The Nextra battery achieves 175 watt hours per kilogram, surpassing the 160 watt hours per kilogram of BYD's Blade battery, a benchmark in the LFP space. This means sodium ion batteries can now store more energy in a smaller, lighter package, while costing less than half as much as lithium ion batteries. The most jaw dropping feature is their longevity. CATL claims the Nextra battery retains 80% of its capacity after 3.6 million miles of driving an unprecedented figure in battery history. For comparison, most EV batteries today are considered durable if they last 200,000, 300,000 miles. A battery that lasts millions of miles could outlive multiple vehicle life cycles and still be reused in homes or grids long after its automotive use ends. With a lifespan exceeding 10,000 charge-discharge cycles, these batteries are built for decades, not years. For the average driver, this durability means an EV purchased at 18 could still be operational at 88 if the rest of the car holds up. Charging speed is another strength. With peak charging rates of 5C, 400, 500 kilowatts, these batteries can recharge at blistering speeds far beyond most current EV infrastructure. This could slash charging times and make EVs far more convenient for long trips or quick top up. Beyond EVs, the broader implications extend to renewable energy storage. Sodium ion batteries' low cost could make solar and wind energy systems more affordable, accelerating the transition away from fossil fuels. Electric cars, already on track to undercut combustion engine vehicles, could become significantly cheaper within five years, reshaping the global automotive landscape. CATL is already moving quickly. The company has begun manufacturing Nextra batteries for its battery swapping business, a growing segment in China's EV ecosystem. Much like NEO, which pioneered battery swapping stations, CATL is rapidly expanding its network, activating 103 new stations in August alone and planning 105 more.